Russia is the world's largest country by far, but everybody knows that. But not everybody knows that Russia is actually a federation that's actually made up of a huge number of federal subjects. And today we're going to talk about an absolute behemoth of a republic, Yakutia. Hello and welcome to 7 Fact. Officially known as Saha, Yakutia is a huge Siberian Republic, part of the Russian Federation. With more than 3 million square kilometers, Yakutia is the largest federal subject of the country and the largest subnational governing body in the world. To put that into context, that's almost as big as India, or France, Spain, Sweden, Norway, Germany, Finland, Poland, Italy, Romania, Switzerland, Israel, Luxembourg and Andorra all put together. If that doesn't impress you, I don't know what will. Yakutia is among the few places in Russia where most of the population still leads a traditional life. Local traditions are mostly followed by the Yakut, who live far away from cities and pursue folk crafts, like reindeer breeding, fur trapping, fishing, agriculture and cattle farming. The Yakuts are a Turkic nation, with a Turkic language, and have lived in these parts of the world since at least the 13th century AD. While mostly a peaceful nation, the Yakuts have also rebelled against Russian rule several times in history. The last time they did was actually the last time someone stood up against the Red Army in Russia during the Civil War. After the Yakut revolt ended in 1923, no other armed group in Russia opposed the Bolsheviks. While this is an absolutely humongous place, at the same time, with a population of less than 1 million people, Yakutia is one of the least densely populated places on Earth. In Yakutia, mathematically at least, each inhabitant has more than 3,000 square meters on its own. If Yakutia would be a sovereign country, it would be even less populated than Mongolia, which is currently the country with the lowest population density. The majority of Yakutia's population lives in Yakutsk, the capital and cultural center of the republic, while large areas of the republic are entirely unpopulated. Those areas, which are among the most remote places on the planet, you will find truly untouched nature and undisturbed wildlife far away from modern life and civilization. Before we get to the next fact, I'd like to ask you one thing. This video isn't sponsored, none of them are so far, so perhaps you'd consider supporting this channel by becoming a patron. If you still enjoy my content, go visit my Patreon page and help this channel out. Right, with that said, let's go to fact number 4. Yakutsk is the capital city of Yakutia. The city is just 450 kilometers south of the Arctic Circle and it gets pretty damn cold. The average temperature here is minus 8.8 .8 degrees Celsius. If that doesn't mean much to you, then a minus 38 degrees winter temperature surely gets the information across. This is the coldest major city on the entire planet. But it's not the coldest inhabited place. That honor goes to Oymyakom, also in Yakutia. In this village, temperatures below 50 degrees are nothing uncommon during winter months. The record-breaking, bone-crushing lowest temperature ever recorded here was minus 78 degrees Celsius. To be absolutely honest, I have no idea how on earth can people or any other living being can survive such extreme colds. Yakutia is not just about the cold temperatures and remoteness. This is a place of beauty like very few places on earth. One spectacular natural feature is the Lena and Sinaya pillars. Some 200 kilometers south of Yakutsk, where the Lena and Sinaya rivers meet, nature has formed some truly unique pillars on the banks of the rivers, reaching a height of more than 300 meters. The rocks themselves are about 550 million years old, while this uniquely looking shape took form relatively recently, about 400,000 years ago. The unique beauty has also been recognized by UNESCO, which has included it in its World Heritage List. While the Lena and Sinaya pillars are much more well known, they are not the only spectacular feature of Yakutia. Another incredible sight is the Ulahansis Ridge, a stunningly beautiful mountain ridge in polar Yakutia. This place looks like some ancient Arctic warriors were suddenly petrified by a magic spell. 
If you try to look at them yourself, well, that's unlikely. These granite pillars lie about 3,000 kilometers from the capital city, which by itself is already one of the most remote places in the country. What other spectacular feature can we discover about Yakutia? Hmm. Oh, I know. Most of the Republic is covered by permafrost. If you don't know what that is, it's basically plain old ground, with the particular feature that it doesn't thaw out for pretty much all year. So it's a permanently frozen soil slash ice. Frost is considered permanent if it's stable for more than 2000 years, and the Yakutian permafrost fits that profile. In fact, geologists have found frozen ground all the way to a depth of 1500 meters. As a result, most buildings lying on the permafrost are constructed on stilts of some sort to avoid heating up the soil. Please leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy this content. Leave your comments downstairs and don't forget there's a Patreon page where you can support this channel. I hope to see you next time. Bye.